Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey. This is Ripe Color. And this is the reading for the 17th. I need to get a calendar with very big numbers. <laughs> um, before I begin, I wanted to say that tonight on the 17th, I will be um, a guest star. I, it, it's almost like when we watch television as, as kids and you'd watch the same series all the time and special guest star. So I'm a special guest. I feel like Tuesday well, a special guest star tonight on uh, Bathrobe Jero, Danny Shea, uh, The Man Cave with Scott Allen. And uh, there might be some surprise guests. Mm -hmm. Now, if you look at my community page and you'll figure out who the surprise guests are. And Danny made a picture of me holding a pizza. So I, I wish I could make a pizza. I, I tried making pizza at home once. Well, it wasn't good. It's so much easier just to go and buy a pizza. All right. Um, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. Greetings, I offer IET. I have a really beautiful line of astrology t-shirts as well as one of a kind t-shirts scarves, everything's at right color. And let's get on with the reading. All right. I'm already, I, I was supposed to have left the house already. But so it goes, I got a late start. I got a late start. And it's not like the alarm didn't go off. The alarm did go off. <laughs> I observed it going off. There's no actions. One more. This is for the 17th. Let's see what's going on. For the 17th. All right, one, whoops, two, three. We get this card all the time. All the time. Um, okay, we have two knights. Interesting. Knight of Pentacles, nine of wands, knight of swords. So knights are about action. Knights overall are about action. So this is an unusual knight in that he doesn't move. So this is the guy who builds something. I always liken him to the guy who owns a laundromat. Um, you know, it's slow and steady money. You know, it's not very, it's not tremendously exciting, but he has a laundromat. He knows he's gonna make a certain amount every week, give or take, or there's an average monthly, but it's very foundational. It's very solid. It's very, uh, he's very reliable. He's very, uh, he doesn't move, right? Steadfast, it's like mm -hmm. established. And then we get the nine. So nine is about attainment, but also this nine, um, sorry, I had a eyelash in my eye. Um, this nine, I always feel like, should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go? Should I, have I learned my lesson? Have I learned my lesson? Uh, is it time to surrender or should I continue to fight? So there might be something that you've established that you have that uh, feels a little bit maybe You feel a little bombarded by, you feel a little bit stuck in, right? Because these are both a little bit stuck, right? So there might be something you feel stuck in and you're like, you feel a little overwhelmed. You have a little schmata on your head. I love this little, little, little schmata. This is not a fashion statement. This is a schmata, okay? Um, schmata means a rag. You know, he's a little bit beaten up. He's a little bit overwhelmed. He's a, he's, he's a little bit tired. He's a little bit like, right? Something new comes in, new idea, a, a new message, new uh, flash of inspiration, a new something comes in. So the energy is going to, sometimes when you least expect it, you know, you're just sitting there going, oh, oh, and then all of a sudden, huh? Oh, maybe I'll do this. Maybe I could look at it like this. Maybe I'll have a sandwich. Yep. Okay. 
So the way I see this card, this is choices. The way I understand this card for me, so two is about choices, all twos are about choices. And these are, they're both good choices. This is <clears throat> the past, it's, a, it's fertile. It's, it worked, right? It's the laundromat. This is a chain of laundromats, <laughs> like George Jefferson. Um, this is, first of all, it's on higher ground. So it's almost, it's closer to spirit in a way. And it's also fertile. And it's a, a larger opportunity. This is a larger opportunity. This is more hopeful. This is more, uh, I'm looking toward the future. So maybe, you know, it, it's like the, this dream that you have or this thing that you built, um, you want to expand, you want to, for it to get bigger. You want for it to uh, go off in different directions. You want for it to uh, be more, uh, I don't know, stable. You want it to be more seen. You want it to be, I think more seen is the thing, right? Because if you put something on the world stage, so let's say you have a little business, right? Let's say it's an internet thing, right? Well, uh, if you open a website, all of a sudden the whole world can see you. It, it's like that. It's like that. I mean, yeah, yeah. Do you think cha ching, cha ching, cha ching is going to come in one day? Probably not. But, but once you put it out and expand it into the world, it's like you have a chance of somebody in a different continent seeing it and saying, Oh, I really like your work. You want to collaborate, or I really like your work, and I'm going to buy something, or I like your idea, and um, thank you. So it feels like that. It feels like there's something that you have sort of established, and this could very easily be business because it, it's this, and you feel a little bit like there's nowhere to go. There's nowhere to go with this. Oh, there's nowhere to go with this. My head hurts. Du, du, du. Then all of a sudden, this comes through. <laughs> oh, oh, I could do that. And this could be a message from somebody else. This could be something you see on the internet. This could be something in your mind. This could be, it could be a lot of those things, any of those things. And then you're like, yeah, I haven't been thinking big enough. I think I, I, it's time to start thinking larger, more open, more um, expansively, expansively, because for me, this is about expanse. Also, it's the two and the three of, of wands are, it's almost like, it's weird. It's almost like two energies, but they're, the cards are very similar. and. This is like, okay, I'm gonna be expansive. That's my choice. And then the three has the strategy. The three is the real international card. The three is like, here's my strategy. It's creative. It's more solid. I have three and I'm going toward it. This one, he's sort of just contemplating it, dreaming it, uh, envisioning it. Anyway, expansiveness. That is the energy of the day. Blessings to you. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Talk soon. Bye.